from NBC News, this is Today with Matt Lauer. The legendary Mel Brooks has had one goal during his six decades in entertainment, and that is to make people laugh. Well, tonight he's bringing one of his most beloved films to Broadway. NBC's Brian Williams recently sat down with the 81-year-old comedian to talk about young Frankenstein. It is the most eagerly anticipated musical to arrive on Broadway this season. Mel Brooks' stage version of his 1975 film classic, Young Frankenstein. The last time Brooks did this, turning one of his films into a Broadway show, was six years ago with the producers. He admits he's a tweaker, tweaking his script right up until the last minute. Are you the best judge of your own comedy? Absolutely, I am the best judge of my own comedy. If the audience laughs around you and you don't laugh as hard, is I'll, there still a problem with that joke? I'll tweak. I used to be a drummer. Clearly, I, you still have the skills. I, I am a great drummer. And as a comedy writer, I know where the rim shots are. <laughs> the drummer in me says, that should be syncopated. Let the audience discover that joke. Let them go crazy. And th those are the best laughs in the world when the audience discovers it. I am Frau Blucher. Fans of the film version of Young Frankenstein can rest assured Brooks has been careful to preserve all of the film's iconic lines. I don't wish to embarrass you, but I am a rather brilliant surgeon. Perhaps I can help you with that hump. What, what hump? hump? many of the most Hello. famous scenes from the film would you like to have a roll in the hay roll, roll, serve as inspiration for some of the musical's biggest numbers when you go from the screenplay which was brilliant to live human actors every night standing out there what were the challenges where did you start we were very lucky in that the, the screenplay that gene wilder and i wrote had a lot of good stuff in it. Oh, my friend, my friend. For instance, the entire know, blind man scene for the pleasure of another is taken being. right out of the movie Sometimes and hurled on the station. Wow, is it big? It's a big, it's the biggest theater on Broadway. Brooks says there's yeah. nothing Eight, like writing eight, for the theater. That's something of a surprise for a man who started his career writing for television, like Sid Caesar's show of shows, and went on to create some of the most memorable film comedies of all time. I adore live musical theater. I mean, it, what a treat that is. You know, that's better than a chocolate-covered cupcake. Coming back to Broadway is just makes your hair stand on end. Deep love. At last I found deep love. Let's take a, a husband and wife from Joliet, Illinois. They've saved for their weekend getaway in New York. They come to your show. What is your wish for them? Well, my, my wish for them is, is that they have an unforgettable experience. This was our greatest night in the theater. This is the best show, the best show we've ever seen in our lives. That's what I always aim for. I always aim, you know, for the best. And again, Young Frankenstein opens tonight on Broadway. And you can see more of Brian Williams' interview with Mel Brooks also tonight on NBC Nightly News. And up next, Christmas traditions with Caroline Kennedy. But first, this is Today on NBC.